Last night, we had to take Stella to the hospital. Stella has been complaining of her heart bothering her, her heart beating too fast. So we just packed the bag and we ran to the ER. I tried not to show Stella that I was scared. I tried to be strong. I tried to not let her know that I was very concerned. Obviously, it was a very, very scary situation. We got home late last night. But today, she has an appointment with the cardiologist. You want one of these to, over there or no? You just want water? No, I'm going to pack you a juice just in case. She's just unpacking her little snack. I don't know how long we're going to be there for. I don't know what test they're going to run on her. So tell grandma what we're doing today and tell Titi what we're doing today. Tell me. Tell them. Why are we going to the doctor? I'm sick. Sick, sick. What's going on with your little hearties? It's getting fast. Is what? It's getting fast. Is beating too fast? She was telling me that her heart is was hurting and that it was beating really fast. It's been going on for like the last month, two, three weeks. I, w I hope it's that it's nothing, you know, but... But for her to say it more than once on different occasions, obviously something is up. That's weird. I know. Considering her history, she gotta go to ER. Let me pack her bag. Um, she has three holes in her heart. So people live their lives with holes in their heart and they're fine. She just wants to keep an eye on it. To see like all those like stickers on her to get her EKG and them trying oh to find God. like, it broke my heart. And we're gonna see the doctor that we saw when she was first born. So that's a good thing. She'll have like all her records and stuff. How many days old was she when they first realized she had a heart condition? Like three or four days, right? Yeah, she was like a week old. That was scary. She was so little. So, so, so tiny. Where is this office at? Girl, I have no idea. Let me see. Good question. Check. Ugh, is it downtown? What? Lou lives downtown. I don't know if you want to call him. Let him know. I told him all the information. He was like, yeah, I'll be there. And then last night he was like, um, I don't want to film, so I don't know if I'm going to go. Did he ask you any questions about her? If she was OK. Is OK? I hope it's nothing serious for real, though, because I just can't handle that. No. No, I know you can't. None of us could. Yeah. You're going to be OK, right? Mm -hmm. I think you promised me you're gonna be okay. Yeah. I hope we can go to this appointment and they do another echo and everything comes out a-okay. That's what I'm praying, but obviously I don't know what to expect. And it's very sad that I'm doing all of this by myself and trying to figure this out by myself. Not having, you know, Stella's dad's support, it hurts. But then at the same time, this is just something that we've been doing since day one and I don't know anything else. So I've just been doing what I got to do for my children. Yeah, give me the kisses. Yay, puppy! Give yeah. mommy good sugars. No, like this. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday! Yay! <laughs> I love my baby. 